All right, Doc Positive here, leader of the pack at the Paws Veterinary Clinic. And we're here with Bruno! Now, Celia here, she has a sense of humor. She said she had to pick a big name for a little dog. I love these little guys, these little Papillons. One of Doc's favorite movies of all time. Papillon, the little butterfly dog, with their ears. But what we're showing here with Bruno is, if you look underneath his eyes, he has that tear staining underneath each eye, and that is called epiphora. E-P-I-P-H-O-R-A. Now, epiphora is tear staining that's more apparent on dogs that have a white coat because the, the tears themselves. But that epiphora in these small dogs like Maltese, Yorkies, teacup poodles, papillons is because Bruno's eyes produce tears. And those tears on each eye, there's usually a duct and the tears go down through the duct and they drain back into the back of his throat. But in little dogs like this, sometimes the tear ducts, the openings in the corners of their eye are so small that when they produce a lot of tears, the tears stream down over the side of the face. If he were a black dog or a brown dog, you would not see that. But because he's got white on his face, he has tear staining called epiphora. What do you need to do about that? Just keep that area clean. Now, pet stores sell dozens of different products to keep that area clean. They sell white eyes, bright eyes, no tears, clear eyes. What that tells me if they sell that many different products is none of them work well. Because if they worked well, they would have one product. Oftentimes what happens with these dogs is as they grow, as those tear ducts get bigger, they open up a little bit, and then the tears will start streaming down where they should. Now, sometimes not, and uh, this is something that some dog breeders cheat when they go to show their dog. Because if they're going to the Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show, they know the judge does not want to look at tear staining, so oftentimes they'll get a veterinarian to prescribe tetracycline. And that tetracycline will clear up the tears, and, uh, but it's a bit unethical. Also, you don't want to use tetracycline in a young puppy because just like tetracycline in young children, it will cause uh, staining and damage to the teeth. So that's our explanation of Epiphora for Celia here and Bruno, our little Papillon, because that's the way we roll here with Doc Positive, leader of the pack. We believe in educating people on why not just giving you medicine. Bye now.